Motor Week is made possible by rockauto.com. If you drive a car long enough, sooner or later, you'll probably see spots on the pavement underneath the car when you park it. Well, that could mean a lot of different things, but how do you determine what's going on? Well, of course, one of the things you could do is to look to see where the leak is coming from. You know, is it coming from the front, which could be the engine or the radiator or any of a dozen different things, transmission and so on? Or is it coming from the rear, which would be a differential or brake fluid or something like that? Now, say you bring it to me in my repair shop, what am I going to do? Well, I am going to use dye. I'm going to put it into the system that I think is leaking. Then I'm going to use a black light like this one after we run the car for a few minutes and we're going to shine it at various spots under the car that are wet. Here we can see the dye fluoresce. We follow that back to its source and that tells us what's wrong. Now, you can buy these kits relatively inexpensively. They come with an inexpensive black light that works up to a point. You still may need to take it to a shop. Now, looking at where the leak is, that gives you diagnostic tools. Looking at the color of the leak, well, that gives you more information. And that is, if we see pink, that typically means that we have transmission fluid leaking. Dark brown, ugly looking uh, stuff, that is going to be engine oil in most cases. Then we have power steering and brake fluid, which can be clear or kind of a grayish color. Then we have coolant, and coolant comes in a variety of colors, pink and yellow and uh, red and green and so on. Well, by looking at what is leaking, getting the color to help identify it, and where the leak is located, that can save you a lot of time in diagnosing, whether you're doing it yourself or paying for it. And if you have a question or a comment, drop me a line right here at MotorWeek.